In Durham County, detention officers' uh, openings have doubled in just the past year. As CBS 17 has told you many times before, deputies are having to fill in at the jail to make up for that shortage. CBS 17's Crystal Price spoke with the Durham County Sheriff about a new step they're taking. Uh, they're forced to make sure that those shifts are covered. Yes, here in Durham County, they have almost 90 detention officer vacancies. That's something that Sheriff Clarence Burkhead says he never thought he would see. Now deputies will have to get dual certified to work in the jail. How serious is the detention officer shortage right now in Durham County? Well, it's very serious, as is our law enforcement shortage. Sheriff Clarence Burkhead says he never thought he'd see so many detention officer openings. As right now, there are 87. That's double the amount of vacancies they had in June of last year. I don't think anyone uh, you would speak to today would say we forecasted this three years ago, four years ago, ten years ago. Absolutely not. Sheriff Burkhead says as detention officers retire, they're challenged with finding people who want to work in the profession. Uh, it's not as attractive as it has been. That's the national climate. For the last year, he says deputies have had to work an overtime shift at the jail every month to make up for the shortage. Since the shortage has gotten worse, Burkhead says deputies will now be required to get dual certified to serve as both detention officers and law enforcement officers. And that just allows me to sort of mix and match, move folks around as the need arises. He says they'll take a two-week course and deputies will start taking it in the fall. Burkhead says the good news is they've seen an increase in applications for detention officers. And a raise approved by Durham County Commissioners now has starting detention officers making more than $44,000 a year, which is roughly a $5,000 increase. So I am hopeful that the increase in salaries and the, and the great innovative programs and strategies that we have here at the Durham County Sheriff's Office is going to attract uh, more qualified applicants and certainly be, uh, be able to retain them. In Durham, Crystal Price, CBS 17 News.